Welcome to Espresso, Espresso Yourself. So today we are on the hunt for the best coffees, aka lattes. Because it's hot. It's so it's hot. It's so hot. We are going to do iced coffee, but we're latte girls. So we decided to get more flavor. lattes, little milk in there. So our first stop is going to be Hillside. We already got our coffees, our lattes. So good. And we also got free donuts. Which, they what gave us do donuts. Chocolate? Chocolate de abuelita. So they're beautiful. They look gorgeous, don't they? Yeah, they do. Okay, so we're going to go to four different coffee shops. We have our masks, of course and hopefully re like get them to go, get all the coffees to go because we're- Or sit outside. Yeah, or sit outside because we're still social distancing. And of course, Mills and I have been basically not quarantining together, but- Right. We go to the gym cute. together, we like eat together. So we've decided that like, okay, we'll hang out with each other and then try to keep it at minimum with everyone else. So we don't go stir crazy just hanging out by ourselves. So, yeah, but we're still much. trying to take all the precautions that we can because we're trying to be safe and make sure we don't, you know, do anything stupid. Yes, true. So we're gonna go check out these coffee shops and give you our ratings on all of them. Ah. I'm ready to get hyped. I wanna be <laughs> jacked. We are gonna be so caffeined out. I wanna be up for four days after this. <laughs> We're gonna be freaking out after this. I don't know why we got mediums. We should have gotten smalls. But I haven't drinking any. No, you haven't either. We haven't had any coffee today. It's already like 2 p.m. It's much needed. Yeah. We've both already worked out. We've like done a lot today. I feel like I want to be up all night. <laughs> and I have to work too tomorrow. So LOL. <laughs> LOL. I'm excited. We're excited. We're excited. excited. Very excited. Mm. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> I guess I have a mask I can clean it up with. <laughs> okay, so we're here at Hillside. Say hi. Hello, darling. Darling. Hi there. David is here. <laughs> and me. Of course, Mills, darling. So we ordered ice lattes. I got mine with a hint of coconut, and it's an almond latte. And what'd you get? Well, I haven't ordered it yet. And oh, just kidding. Hopefully, he's not making it yet. But <laughs> I'm getting the same thing except not a coconut because I don't really like coconut. What? So, yeah, sorry. I prefer to show that. There you are. Thank yeah. you. Thank you, darling. So I got, we both got almond lattes, but mine has vanilla and hers has coconut. So You've already tried it, have you? I just took a sip. Okay, here we go. I'm trying mine. Okay. She's fake, haha. Cheers. Just kidding. <laughs> Cheers. Oh, oh my god. So it tastes like a better version. Of, you know how like the McDonald's like frappes are so good, but you know they're like a thousand calories? <laughs> it tastes like that, except healthier for you. I've never had one. Oh, they're amazing. Oh really? Oh, mm. they're so good. Bomb. Bomb.com. Okay, so we are here downtown. We came to District Coffee. Yes, we're here. I'm, hopefully this is a parking spot, lol. Lol, <laughs> no one knows. Um, so we're gonna go into District. I don't know if they are gonna if they let people sit inside yet or not, so we'll see. If not, we can just yeah, chill. Yeah, we'll probably around. just come back in the car and drink it. And but drink it we're gonna go in and get some coffees. We had a little bit of time in between our last one, so. Yeah, I had a little bit of a champagne, just, just like just like a slip. Just a, just a sliver, just, just, a sliver. just a sliver. Like literally, it was two sips. Truthfully, I'm truthfully, honest. honestly, honest. Let's do it. Just some words of wisdom, guys. Very important. Try not to get so caught up in the future and try to appreciate where you are. Wow. Oh, oh it feels so good. Y'all, so hot out here. It feels so good. Oh my gosh, so exciting. Oh, they do let people sit inside. Okay. What'd you get? Rose latte with almond milk. So Rose. We'll see how that tastes. Wow, maybe you're a plant mommy. <laughs> this guy has a plant daddy shirt. Okay, 
it is. Okay, so we got our iced lattes. Cheers, <gasps> number two. Oh, I just spilled some on me. Nice. Oh, wow. That's really good. Very different on the outside. I'll, I'll tell you what I think when I'm in the cake out. Okay, so we just tried these. Um, I got the district latte, and she said this had uh, dark chocolate, coconut, and almond, right? You don't like coconut, though. Maybe that's it. Maybe that's why. Okay, yeah. I don't know, because I got the rose latte. doesn't taste like rose at all. What does it taste like? It's just like... It's really watery, and I'm a little confused of that. I don't yeah. know if it's the almond milk that they used. Uh-huh. Because I can taste the espresso. I just can't taste the rose. So like I like I don't like dislike it. I just feel like I like the other coffee better. I do think it's a little watery, um, and also I'm not sure if I got like the right one because I've been to district a thousand times. Yeah, we, so I've been good. here like so many times. I always get the matcha coconut latte. It's like bomb. It's my favorite, and their avocado toast is so good. Their avocado toast here. I'm gonna tell you what. If you have not had the avocado toast at the district, then you're not living your life right because yeah. it is so good. <laughs> yeah. Like, and they have like a couple different flavors of the avocado toast. It's so good. Yeah, like they have different seasonings and stuff. And I really like their hot drinks. And I'll tell you what. Here's also another thing about me is I'm not the biggest iced coffee person. Like I generally like hot coffee, but it's just so dang hot outside. It's so hot. Like I how are we gonna? We would die. Yeah, we would like die. Be a hundred degrees. But their hot coffee, like all their lattes, like their are so they have like pretty little creations on top Love yeah that. this wasn't my favorite I right. mean I'd still buy it if that makes sense like right. I'd still purchase it but compared to like the hillside one it's I don't know right. I don't know it's not the vibe I think I like I think I like the hillside better but I don't think this one is necessarily bad exactly like because I do love district coffee and I've had so many different things from there that mm -hmm. maybe it was just like this batch I think it might have just be this bad. Because anytime I'm downtown, I always come to District Coffee. Right. Like, I usually come to Coffee Box. I really like Coffee Box as well. Some of you guys probably know Coffee Box. Yeah. Um, but I come to District for, I always would come for avocado toast. Like after a mm. live shot, after I got off TV, I would come here. Mm. Okay. All right. Yeah. So pretty good. We're going to go and try the next place. Yes. So we're here at Fahrenheit 180. I got the La Colombe latte, which is only available in New York and LA. Just so you guys know, this is a and also El Paso. And <laughs> apparently El Paso, they have it on draft here. Like I'm shook it. What did you get? Shook it. So I got the charcoal latte, which I guess there's real charcoal in here, which is kind of scary. And it is good, but it tastes like a milkshake. Like I'm like, is there any coffee in here? Because it doesn't feel that way. We don't know if there's coffee. So I got a true latte, and she got a charcoal latte. Cheers. Cheers. Hey. Oh, I drank it before you, haha. <laughs> Why do I spill all of my coffees? And you're wearing white. You need I know. Drink. Okay, I'm really hungry, so I'm gonna eat the macaroon, right? Oh, yeah, we also got some macaroons. Oh, which one are you gonna okay. get? the matcha one. Okay, so cheers. Cheers. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That's so good. I love macaroons. This is like the favorite one. Mm -hmm. Wow. And Come it's on. not like too much, it's like just enough. This is so good. Mm -hmm. I love my hair and this one's really good. Mm -hmm. Perfect amount of sweet. Very cookies and cream. Mm -hmm. yeah, there's no espresso or caffeine in the charcoal latte, so I'm honestly confused why I got it because it is basically just a milkshake. It literally has no coffee in it, so therefore it cannot be a part it's of the It's just coffee. sugar. It's not coffee. It's, not, it's okay. I had a true latte. And I, I tried some of hers, and it was, it was pretty good. Honestly, the charcoal latte is good. Like, let me be clear on that. Yeah, it's yeah. good, but it's not coffee. It's not coffee. It's a milkshake. But the La, La Colombe latte. Like a true latte, no added syrups, no added sugar. That's why I'm sleepy because I just have any caffeine in it. <laughs> but you already had a coffee. Two only, coffee. only, only had half of one technically. The hillside one. I had seven five percent of the hillside one. <laughs> well, I, I need this is bomb. For me, this is my favorite. I'm still on Hillside is my favorite. Yeah. Hillside is yeah. my favorite. Hillside was really, really good, but I was like, is it the sweetness that makes it really good or is it the coffee that makes it really I'm good? I'm just still in shock right now. Like, <laughs> I can't believe there's that many caffeine in it. You should have asked. I just did. I'm like, hey, so many caffeine in it. Like, no. no, just sugar. <laughs> just sugar. Yep, they're not real. They're not real. <laughs> not real. <laughs> 
<laughs> Not real lemons. But I love this. Like I would love it in my house. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Thank you so much. Yeah, no problem. Okay. All centered, alas. We came to Massey Meadows now, and we actually are just sharing one because I'm coffeeed out. I'm like, really I'm not because having of a heart attack. <laughs> She's having a heart attack, but I wish I was. But again, like I said, y'all, the last one didn't have caffeine. I didn't drink the second one. So it's been like three hours since I really had caffeine. What I really like is I'm actually more of a hot coffee kind of person, so I'm excited to try this one. I've actually had it before, so I know it's good, but we'll see if, you know, they yes. made it correct. Yeah, so. What about you? You like iced or hot butter? I mean, summer, during the summer, like, I'm all about the iced mm -hmm. coffee, but I do get in the mood for the hot coffee. Like, okay. obviously, fall, winter, that's when I yes. drink hot. So I like both, especially now it's like, it started raining randomly, mm -hmm. so it kind of like it gives that vibe. It kind of went away, yeah, it's confusing. Yeah. Doesn't know what it wants to do. Bipolar weather, but um, <laughs> okay, yeah, so. I'm excited to try it. Okay, yeah. shall we? We shall. Okay. Oh yeah, this is the best one by far. Really? But I really love hot coffee, so it's hard to. So maybe you're biased. But I'm a little biased, yeah. Okay, you have to try it now, okay. it's so good. Okay, trying the latte. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. You like that one? That's so good. Oh, that's a cool shot. That is so good. So is this your favorite? Wait, I think this is my favorite. Man, this is tough, right? Cause it's like- This is so hard because it's hot. So it's totally different. I don't know. Wow. That's so tough. good, right? That's tough. So this is Massy Mino, so let's see. Up a little bit. Cheers. Cool. Okay, that's freaking good. That's so freaking good. Mm. Okay, good to know. Really good to know. They also have wine and beer here. This is like such a cozy place. You know what I mean? Like there's space. So pretty. Lots of green. Your girl's about to. Okay, so we made it back to the house. We were kind of coffeeed out, full of so caffeine. So we ate some food. We're feeling better now. So much better. And water, because we clearly needed We that. needed so much water. Like, I was so dehydrated. Honestly, I needed food. I was starving. Yeah, I was starving. We needed water. And now, we're done. Yeah, right. yeah, so that was pretty much the video. I would say my favorite was... So for me, my favorite was Masi Menos. Is that how you say it? Mas y menos. Mas y, mas y menos? Mas y menos. Mas, mas? Mas ma y menos. Mas y menos. Like, Why more and less. Mas y menos. Mas y menos. Mas y menos. Mas y menos. My favorite was mas y menos, and I know it's kind of hard because that was the only one that we got that was hot. Yeah. So maybe we should have stuck with all hot, but of course it was literally like over 100 degrees. It was like so good though. Yeah, like, it was amazing. I think even if we had gotten it iced, it would have been like equally as good. I think so too. I just like loved the silkiness, the smoothness. Like it was so delicious. It wasn't too sweet. It wasn't bitter. It was honestly just exactly what you needed out of a cup of coffee. And just the fact that that was like our last stop, so we were already like coffee, well I was coffeeed out. I was like, Ugh, I don't want any more coffee. Right, I wasn't because I didn't really, apparently don't know how much caffeine is. <laughs> it's okay, <laughs> order the wrong thing, it's yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but, so I wasn't, and I feel like that like hit the spot for me. Yeah, it was great though. And then I would say my second was Hillside, mm -hmm. and then Fahrenheit 180, and then last but not least, District Coffee. I might would have put, uh, I'm gonna do Massey Minnows, Hillside, District, and then Fahrenheit. And the only reason I say this is because I just didn't like what I got at Fahrenheit. Yeah. It didn't have caffeine in it. So. It wasn't like a real latte, so. Yeah, it was my fault, not theirs. But their lattes are bomb. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below your favorite coffee shop. No matter what city you're in, let us know because who knows, maybe one day we'll come to your city and try your coffees. And also, it's so important, especially after COVID-19, I mean, obviously it's still going on, but yeah. it's so important to support locals. I'm so glad we picked Yeah, all, all local, local spots, but make sure to comment down below your favorite spot in El Paso or your favorite spot in your city, and we will see you soon. Bye. Don't forget to like and subscribe.